All right, guys, we're back here with another uh, quick app review. If uh, you know, this is not a very fun one, but one that I thought was kind of interesting. It was really on the top list of uh, newly downloaded free apps, and I just kind of went in there and and it caught my eye and wanted to get it. It, it was it was I'm pretty sure it was in the top twenty. So I thought, heck, let's check it out. This is the IRS to go app, and one you can see right here, you can check your refund status super quick, super easy. Uh, just download the app. Obviously, here plug in your social, it's your status, and your refund amount, and you'd be able to get your status. So obviously, that works for all you W two employees out there. Um, I'm myself. I'm 1099, so I'm a uh, self employed contractor. So when I do that, um, you know, this is not this is not of any help to me at all. So uh, a lot of you out there in the same boat, you know, you can definitely come over here and do something that's really cool um, and actually use the payment. So you can. You know, if you're like me, you've got to pay quarterly and an estimated quarterly payment uh, to the government so that, uh, you know, you don't get penalized at the end of the year. Uh, so you can actually come in here. You can pay directly from your bank account. You know, so if you're an individual taxpayer, IRS Direct Pay offers you a free, secure payment method. Um, or you can come in here and pay with your debit or credit card. Choose an approved payment processor to make a secure tax payment online or by phone. Um, you know, so obviously you come in here. And it's going to actually redirect you to the IRS direct pay and you'd be able to make a payment. So it would look much like this and you'd come in here and put how much you want in there. So let's go ahead and get done. Go back to the app and you can see that if you actually come in here to, uh, you know, they offer three payment processors. Uh, so you could come in here and actually pay with a $2.55 debit card or flat fee uh, or you kick it over here with a 1.96 credit card fee. So that could get substantial if you have a lot of income you're paying on, but at the same time, you can put it on credit at least. Um, so that's kind of cool. You just click the make payment down here if you wanted to do that. You could pay by the pay1040.com. Of course, they have a $2.58 debit card fee, or and of course, those are flat, so that's pretty nice if you actually have a debit card and you don't obviously want to mail in your estimated payments anymore or even use the uh, older route, the, you know, the ETA, EFTPS site, um, that was that third party that pays the government. Um, this is actually directly to the IRS outside of even though the EFTPS is. It, it kind of is seems like this might be the new one-stop shop for it. Or you could come over here to officialpayments.com backslash fed, $2 fat debit card fee or 1.99 credit card fee. And you can see, you can come in here and actually see this stuff. So that's pretty cool. They've got a little section, free tax help, obviously, uh, you know, IRS free file, uh, free tax prep site locator or ARP, um, you know, so you can come over here, connect with them. Uh, I don't know who would really actually do that, but anyway, um, okay. You go over here, you can type a username and key. I'm not sh quite sure about this one, but obviously, uh, the majority of, you know, people are probably going to want to come into here and, and actually check the refund status. So, uh, Go for it. Super quick, super easy. If it actually helps you, uh, let me know if you, you see it down there. If it was super easy as soon as you hit get status, does it tell you? The one thing I noticed that you do have to have, though, is the refund amount. So you might already have to obviously, you know, have your taxes done, have uh, the amount that has been submitted. And then I think at that point, you'd be able to get your status and see, uh, yeah, where your refund status is. So anyway, uh, yeah, throw a comment down below if it worked really easy for you. Uh, it's nothing I can really use. I'll be actually paying them more. So anyway, just kind of wanted to break it down and a refresher. I actually did get a check because uh, my, my mic cut off halfway through this, so I'm splicing the video. I did check. As of right now, this is the number one app that's free downloads in the uh, iTunes store. So I thought that uh, it was definitely worth a download, definitely worth a video to bring it to you guys because it's obviously a, a hot rolling app so anyway hope you guys like it um please uh, hit that subscribe button i do a video a day for a year showing you guys the youtube process can we make it can we start to hit those thousand uh, subscribers four thousand watch hours and uh really just pumping a lot of content out there so hope you guys like this video and uh see you guys in the next one see you guys